In this video, I'm going to tell you about the story about how I got to where I am now running an online business. I've been getting loads of DMs from people just getting started and I was only in their shoes a couple of months ago. So I'm going to bring you closer to me and show you how I got here as well. So where did it all start? Well, when I was younger, like many people, I looked up to YouTubers. I didn't want to be an astronaut. I didn't want to be a fireman. I wanted to be a YouTuber. And I guess that's just Gen Z. So I would be watching all these gaming YouTubers, playing games with my friends, doing all this. And 12 year old me was thinking, oh, you know what? I'm going to become a YouTuber. So I started creating videos around like Minecraft and things like that. And I also learned how to edit them in Premiere Pro. All self-taught, clearly not the best editing skills. I would create these videos and, you know, they were doing well. They got two, three views every time. Then I was thinking, you know what? Maybe YouTube isn't for me. Then again, like, like again, I am 12 years old. So I took a break from YouTube and I continued on with school. It was only a short break now. It was probably two, three years. But eventually I was like, I sort of want to make videos again. And that's when TikTok came along. And I started creating all these comedy skit videos for TikTok. And they done really well. I was getting 500 million views for these crappy videos. But I guess they were, were relatable. And that was through the time where we were all locked in our houses. And I started traveling the world. And this is when I was getting back into making videos. So I said, I'm going to film all this. So I started creating these vlog type videos for YouTube. These ones done better than my Minecraft ones. They were getting a nice 10 views per video. <laughs> Not only messing. But um, it was really fun. I had so much fun making those videos while I was traveling. Then... That stopped again. It came to the end of school, where everybody was going off, seeing what they were going to do with their lives, seeing, seeing what colleges they were going to go to. And I was thinking, like, I don't want to go to college. I was like, school's not for me. I hate school, even though I love learning now. But I looked into ways that I could start up my own business. When I was like 15 years old, I already tried to start up a protein supplement business. And it failed, <laughs> but um, I got back into it, started researching businesses. I learned over that time that I loved travel. So I was thinking, how can you run a business and travel at the same time? And I came across Iman Gaji, who was doing that. He was uh, running a paid ads agency at the time. And I started watching his videos and seeing the freedom that he had in life where he could travel to wherever he wanted and still work. He had location freedom. And I was thinking, that's something I could do. So I started researching paid ads agencies and a lot of people were saying it's quite saturated. So I was thinking, you know what, maybe, maybe this wouldn't be the best move. But I continued to look into the agency space and I realized paid ads isn't the only type of agency. There's so many more. There's copywriting, content creation, social media management, so much things you can do. I said, what skills do I already have? I had video editing from my time making Minecraft videos and from my time making TikToks. I also knew what worked because I was getting those hundreds of thousands of views on TikToks. So I said, could this be an agency? Could I, could I do a content short form agency? And I looked into it more. I found people who were doing it. And I, I, I joined a program and I, I learned about the business space. I knew how to edit. I didn't know how to get clients. So I eventually learned all about that and actual agency business model. I formed it into what I'm doing today, which is a short form content agency for business owners, content marketing. And that's kind of how we get to the point where I'm at now. And it's crazy because I've been doing this for about a year now. I've made money while I'm traveling. Every time I've traveled, I've probably done about four or five trips since I've started up this business. And every single trip, I've made money, not lost money. It's, a, it, it's crazy to think about, but the way it's working. And that's kind of how I got started in this agency space even though i'm not the most successful in it nowhere near it actually but it is crazy to think about and i am happy i feel free and that's kind of where i'm at now so if you want to continue to see the journey that i'm on and see 
where I will be going because I am scaling month by month. It's just going up. It hasn't started going down yet, which is a good thing. But if you want to continue to see how I get on on this journey and how I do, then make sure you subscribe. Make sure you go follow me on Instagram then as well, at Luke Histon. I'll see you in the next one.